and today we're going to talk about five ways to make money off of TikTok. Today's video is sponsored by Boosted, an app that allows you to edit intro and outro videos for your business. Now, if you guys are new to the channel, welcome. I'm all about teaching y'all how to build passive income, become financially free, and design your best lives. So if you guys are interested in that, make sure to subscribe and hit the bell button so you're notified of my latest videos. A lot of people think that it's impossible to make money off of TikTok unless you're a big influencer like Charlie D'Amelio or Addison Rae, but I've actually been able to make some money off of the platform, so I kind of want to share the different methods in order to do this. So let's just get right into it. The first way is you can go live on TikTok and actually get gifts from people which equates to money so that sounds kind of weird right but let me explain so first off you can only go live if you have a thousand followers or more so before that you're not going to be able to go live to speak to your audience so make sure you build up content and get those followers now once you're able to go live which basically means that you can broadcast to your following in real time and people are going to go in and chat with you and you can answer Answer questions and things like that it's basically like an Instagram live or if you're streaming on YouTube the interesting thing is users can actually buy coins on the platform which can convert to gifts so let me show you that right now so once you go on to TikTok you can tap the top three dots and go into your balance here, as you can see, you can recharge your coins balance and you can pay money to buy these coins. So you can basically buy gifts with these coins and you're gonna be able to send these to people when they go live. Now I'm gonna show you my dashboard when you go into live gifts. You can see that I have a little bit of balance. I've gone live maybe a couple times and essentially you can withdraw when you press withdraw and you can only withdraw when you hit $10. So basically, if you're the type of person who loves to stream and go live all the time, you can make actually a lot of money. And going live can actually help you increase your followers because your lives will be delivered to other people as well. Like when I've gone live, I've seen people follow me through the live. So it's a great way to make money, build an existing relationship with your followers, as well as attract new people onto your platform. I think this is a very interesting interesting way to make money off the platform. I've seen some people make a good amount of money through this method actually and it was really interesting for me when I was first going on the app and I didn't know anything about it so knowing that you can do that is actually really cool. Number two there's the TikTok creator fund. So the TikTok creator fund was announced earlier this year so basically TikTok created this $200 million fund for its content creators in order to support them. And I believe they upped that amount to $1 billion actually to pay out their creators. Now, in order to get in the program, you have to have at least 10,000 followers and you have to have at least 10,000 video views in the last 30 days. And you also need to be 18 years old or older. So once you get accepted into the creator fund, you essentially get paid every day for multiple factors around your videos, including views. TikTok reported that views are actually just one metric that they look at and take into consideration when distributing their payments. So I kind of saw on TikTok's rules that I don't think you're supposed to show your earnings, so I'm probably not going to share it on my phone. But it's not very high, essentially. Like some people are reporting that you're getting basically basically about four cents per thousand views. But if you have this consistent income, it's pretty nice because every day you're getting a little bit. Obviously it's not passive with TikTok. I feel like you actually do have to 
kind of work hard to build up the content and continuously post because I would say TikTok isn't as evergreen because it doesn't keep showing a video from way back when to users. Unlike YouTube where you're basically ranking different videos and people can search for them and it's pretty evergreen. TikTok is more like you put that video out and maybe gets viral but then it pretty much dies in views afterwards. So I would say that the career fund is kind of a nice bonus but it's not gonna make you totally rich it doesn't pay as well as like YouTube does for example all right the third way you can make money on TikTok is through sponsorships and I would say that this is pretty common with all different platforms so basically with sponsorships brands may approach you in order to make some sponsored content for them they might want you to create an ad around their product review their product or something like that in a video and they will pay you a certain amount for that video. Usually the draw for brands is that not only will the influencer be good marketing for them where they're gonna push out the video to their followers, they can also use your asset and promote it as an ad onto the TikTok platform or on other platforms. So those assets are actually very valuable for brands. Now, if you wanna get these sponsorships, you should probably create a media kit. Basically, a media kit is something where you will talk about what you're about, what your brand's about, and how many views you're getting or how many followers you're getting on each different platform and basically show what you can do for your brand. You can create a rate kit essentially with your media kit where you talk about the prices for each of your different offerings. So for example, for YouTube, this is how much you charge. For TikTok, this is how much you charge. For Instagram, for blog posts, whatever that you can offer for the brand, make sure you write it out for them. And then you can present that to brands and see if they wanna work with you. Now that my following is growing more and more, I do get a lot of these offers from different brands all the time, but I definitely wanna make sure that their offering is in line with my brand, that I can bring value to my audience if I promote these different products because you don't want to sponsor different products that you don't recommend at all and your audience is going to be upset about it. It's not in line with what you do. You got to make sure you say no to the ones that don't fit you and don't fit your audience. Now, speaking of which, I wanna talk a bit more about today's sponsor, Boosted. So with Boosted, I actually really felt like this could be great for my audience because it's a very nice tool to create those intro and outro videos that you see on YouTube, on Instagram, that look really cool with these fancy graphics. And you don't have to spend a bunch of money to create these professional videos. You can just do it in the palm of your hand. It took me like five minutes to create the video and it's really handy you can get the app for free and if you want some of the more premium features you can pay a little bit more but it's really cheap so I'm gonna show you a little bit of the app so basically you can go into boosted and they have a bunch of these different templates so you can go into one of them you can tap this and then you can go into the different dimensions so maybe you want to do a long video for like TikTok or square one for Instagram or a longer style for YouTube or something like that. Uh, you go ahead and choose that. And what you can do is you, you can add your media clips here and you can customize it to what you want. There's different color palettes. You can also edit the text. And it's just really easy to use. You can see the different previews here. It's a very cool app. You guys should check it out. Now let's get back to the video. So number four, you can sell products. So what I do with my following is I have a link tree that links to different things like free courses that I've created for my users who are interested in making money through blogging, making money through Etsy. I have the links below. But basically if they go 
into the free course and they see that, oh, I want to learn a bit more, I do have a paid course that I lead them to as well. So that paid course has a step-by-step -step of everything that I've done to get to where I'm at with Etsy and blogging. And essentially, I sell products that way and users can decide if they want to buy it or not. So that is basically one way that I sell products through TikTok. I lead them to this funnel essentially. And how you want to do that is essentially you want to create a lot of value for your customer maybe through your TikTok videos or those free courses and they'll know that you know what you're talking about, that you can help them a lot. Once they trust you, once they know that you know what you're doing, maybe they will buy your course or your product or something like that. So it doesn't have to be courses. People sell shirts like on Teespring, on T-Chip. They sell products on Etsy. So a lot of people send them to these different sites where they can support the creator as well as get value themselves. And lastly, number five, affiliate marketing. So again, I promote different products on Linktree. So essentially with affiliate marketing is you promote different products that you use yourself or you recommend and think it'll give a lot of value to your users you want to make sure when you're doing affiliate marketing it's something that you really passionately care about and you use that you think will really benefit your audience so everything I promote is something I use and I really believe in because I know that it helped me a lot and will help other people a lot as well and when you're promoting these products you can use a unique referral link and basically when people purchase through the link you get a commission as well so it's a win-win situation for the buyer for the seller as well as for me who's promoting it for the owner as well as giving value to the buyer now people like brandon from investment joy says he makes three thousand dollars a month from tiktok which is a huge amount for posting these videos. And it really goes to show that you can actually make money through this platform. So I hope you guys enjoyed these different ways to make money on TikTok. So a lot of these aren't totally new. To me, the creator fun as well as the live gifts are pretty interesting though. A lot of platforms actually do that like on Twitch or on YouTube and stuff like that. But I would say that sponsorships, selling products, and affiliate marketing you can do those things anywhere for sure you can bring people to these different products or different things that will give value to your audience now if you guys like this video make sure to smash the like button comment below and let me know what is actually interesting for you or new for you subscribe hit the bell button to be notified of my latest videos and I'll see you guys in the next one